uh, guys, Jerox here. Welcome back to another episode of the Minecraft Hardcore Super Fat. That's I just said super fat. I I get I guess you could call it super fat. I don't know, <laughs> but it, welcome back to the Hardcore Let's Play here on the Super Flat World. And um, nothing much has happened. Nothing much has changed. I got the farm the farm fully maxed out. I removed all the trees here because I have other plants in this little area. And I'm not sure, but I set up a little composter thing right here. I'm not sure if that was the last episode or not. It's been a very long time since I put up a video for this ser series. So I read a comment saying saying that use the uh, glow ink glow ink sacks to uh, make 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 signs glow, and and that's what I did. So I, I created a couple signs, and I just I placed them around, and I made them glow, and I got the achievement. Yippee I yo, yippee I yay. So, this episode's pretty simple. Not much going on. I'm just going to get some animals for like a couple farms up on debate. So, I probably have enough space for like two farms here. I got, I mean, I got plenty of wood. <laughs> I got, I got, I got a lot of wood here. So, actually, I don't really need this. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some. Right, I'm going to double check here. Okay, so I do have some fences, and I do have some gates, so, but I'm going to definitely going to need more fences for this, so I'm going to just do that, do that by super C, and there we go, now I got plenty of oak fences, and just, I guess, place them along the edges here. And I'll, I'll just divide it down the middle. So I just gotta count real quick. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. So right here is where I'm dividing it up. So I'm probably gonna put cows and sheep in these. So I'm gonna have um, cows and one sheep right there in the other. And you know, just, just just to uh, square it up, I'm gonna just break up some of this this uh, dirt right here. Get some cobblestone. Place it along like so. Alright, now the stone is all placed and the fences are all set up. Now what we need to do is get the gates in. You know, you, you, you gotta make them look nice, so... And I'll just go across the top like so. That's not what I wanted, but I can just cut that down because I got an axe. And now we can start putting animals in these. So I'm going to make actually... I mean, since slime is a thing, isn't really a problem to get. I can actually make leads. So I can just grab my string real quick. Got some slime balls. Unfortunately, I only have enough string to make two leads. Which is fine, that's all I really need. So I'm going to head out here. There's actually a couple sheep right over there. So it shouldn't be too hard to get these. It don't really matter what color they are. So I'll take a gray sheep here. Take a white sheep. And I'm just going to sprint back. Don't mind me, just running with some sheep. <laughs> Go in here. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Going in here, boys. Or girls. I'm not exactly sure what you guys are. I just need one for now. One to come in here. Go inside. Come on inside. Come on inside. Shut you out. Yoink. Yoink. And sheep acquired. And now, we actually... I, I'll, I'll wait for that, actually. I'm, I'm not going to breed them just yet, but what we need to do is get some cows, which I'm just going to jump cut to where I actually get some cows. And then, once I get the cows, I'm going to jump cut again to um me putting the cows in the pen. So... Yep, I'll I'll, ju I'll just see you guys then. 
of course, you know, since I'm out here, like I, it, I kind of got to. I just, I ha, I have to do it. There are no animals in this. There, oh my God! There's cows. Well, there's a cat. Oh yes, they got cows. I'm so happy. I'm just kidding. I've only been running around for like five minutes now. It's fine. And all right, I'm gonna take you. I'm gonna take you, and we're gonna go and have a grand old time get back. So now I got Bessie and Bessie version V2. We can head back to base, which I have no. Where the hell is it? I, oh, it's all the way over there. Oh, this is fun. That's a sight to see. Get a blast! Get a blast! Sayonara! Sayonara! Call your cows, I got my cows. Heading home so I don't die. Getting cows, I got my cows. Man, these slimes are aggressive. <laughs> Ah, so good to be home. I've been running this whole time. I was not once or twice to eat. And, uh, maybe clap a couple slimes. But they almost got clapped me. So I guess I, I really just need one cow for right now. I need one cow to go in the gate. Go into here. The cow, the myth, the legend. Get you... We'll get you. Go on in here, Mr. Cow. And now, you may breed. Yes. You may breed now. <laughs> this is amazing. Sorry, right, so now we got the cows and we got the sheep in here. I'm not sure if I, have any, I don't have any torches in my inventory. There might be some in the chest, in my storage chest, which I, I have a couple, but I'm probably going to have to make more torches, which is fine, I got a good amount of charcoal here, but I'm probably going to have to smelt, cook up some more wood so I can make more torches, but um, let's see, uh, I, I killed a couple iron golems, just going to put torch up here. I don't even need a torch up here. I don't know why I did that. I, I don't know why I did that. But um I guess well, we could I I, I I stole some of this, so we should put so you wanna breed? Okay, so Apparently the hearts aren't going to pop up, but I just got the advancement. Let's go! Alright, so you and you breed. Make me babies! Yes. Okay, so we got... Oh, snap. So this will make... So white and gray will make a light gray... Sheep. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of inbreeding here. Let's see, what's on the agenda? We can now take off this. And now we need to do just a little bit of farming. By little, I mean a lot, because all these, all these crops are pretty much grown. Except for like, maybe like one right here. But I don't really care about like one little crop not being grown. So I'm going to quickly um, just... Jump cut again to where I'm done with this because I mean, y'all really want to see me farm. I don't think y'all want to see me farm, so I'm gonna farm, and you don't have to watch. Ooh. Bruh, how dare you! Ooh. I'm just trying to farm and be chill. Just let me farm and be chill. I know you don't like it, but I didn't ask, so go away. Even farming is dangerous. Alright, and the farming is done. So, now that the farming's all done, we can go into the storage chest up here. I will quickly store all of these. I don't know why I get so excited when I look at these chests, because... I mean, I mean you gotta think, like, 
we're in a flat world. There's nothing going on. Oh, did I just say no? There's always something going on. It's the fact that there's nothing really out here, and we came from nothing to having pretty much a little bit of something here and there. So now what I need to do is I need to sleep and start kidnapping villagers because we need to get ourselves some villagers are going to be a big thing to a. Uh, Let's just say, I'm going to use villagers as a crutch. They're going to carry me throughout this whole let's play, at least until I die. So they're going to supply me with blocks. They're going to supply me with, um, let's see, what else? Supply with blocks. They're going to supply me with food. They're going to supply me with gear, tools, weapons. Pretty much just about anything, really. So I'm going to fix up my yard real quick because it's a little bit of a mess. So yeah, it's some Got a little extra dirt here. And... What I should do is I should clear out my inventory. Get some food real, qu real quick. And then, um... Let's see, just, get, just clear all this stuff out. Alright, I'm probably gonna put in here. Because this is my mildly important stuff chest. Let's see, I don't really need all these on me, because I'm, I'm going to try to steal as many beds as I can. Alright, so let's get ourselves a boat. Get myself some food. Actually, bake myself. That should be enough wheat to make some bread with... 16 bits of bread, which is just enough I need to get to this village over here. But what I should do real quick is I should build myself like just just a little little villager hut to um to start breeding them. Now it's not gonna look like much, but what I'm going to do is I'm act is I'm getting sick of doing first person time lapses. I mean first person time lapses are good and all, but like. Like, I'm not, I'm not exactly sure, like, how they look. I mean, they, they look okay, but they kind of look like crap all at the same time, so... I'm going to do my best to get a camera account on, and I'm going to build... I'm just, I'm just going to straight up build a villager house. I'll build, like, a... No, I'm just going to shut up. I'll let you figure out what I'm going to build. You know what I'm doing. Let's just get straight to it.
You know what? I don't think the slime here likes me. <laughs> so we we managed to get the farm done. I I actually connected connected to my uh, little compound here. So got a little cobblestone bridge. Fence is hooking it up. So these things don't come after me. <laughs> no. Unfortunately, it's not entirely mob proof, but I think iron golems should spawn in this thing if I am, uh, if I'm correct. Although, I think this looks a little bit nicer, I think. If I, like, just, just work on a trim just a little bit. I think that work looks good. Maybe, like, add, add like, another layer. I don't know. I I'm I'm experimenting right now. I mean it it's it looks fine. Like on the outside it doesn't look too bad. Although on the inside though is where the problem is cuz it's pretty bland on the inside. Now, I wasn't sure like how many la how many levels I wanted to do this, but I'm thinking just just the one level here will work out. So I got tor more torches here. I might put a few more torches on the ground level here. Yeah, because I'll just have the beds like lined up along the wall right here. Let me set you here. Oh, it's just a, an aesthetic thing. I mean, then again, lighting is pretty important because I don't want anything really spawning in here and killing off all the villagers. Like, that would just be a bad time. Like, really a bad time. Because... Losing villagers sucks. And since it's in hardcore, it's gonna suck even more. I'm also eventually gonna play like a trap door... Not trap door, but I'm a... Like a pressure plate here. So I can just... It'll just shut by itself. But let's see. So, now that we got the hall done, we gotta like, get beds for it, and then eventually just throw villagers in there, which I actually have some sheep here. I'm gonna get some shears. But I need to clear up my inventory, because I want to run around the, the the villages in the area and just completely, like, knock out all the beds. I'm not sure how much more iron I got. I think I used the rest of my iron. Oh, no, I have enough for two. Enough for one set of shears, which is enough. It's enough. And I'm gonna go quickly walk into here. Let me in, thank you. And I'm just gonna yoink all their wool. Which it's, it's not a lot. That that's a good amount. There we go. Now I can actually make a couple beds, but like I said, I'm gonna have to yoink a bunch of beds as well. So let me clear up my inventory real quick. So pretty much just line up all the beds like so and I want to have both sides completely lined up with beds this could take a while <laughs> no I no I'm thinking I could just say screw it and I and not use this wood here that's what I'm gonna do yeah yeah I don't I don't know why I did this but What's going to happen is um, I'm going to start uh, doing like a little uh, bed breaking montage and I'm just going to I'm and I'm, I'm just going to run around the villages in the area, pick up all the beds and then get them placed in this hall. Kidnap two villagers, put them in here, feed them, make them breed, and then we can get our trading hall set up eventually. But that's gonna be for another episode. But let's get let's get this montage started. I'm gonna break these. Let's get going. Yoink, 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 yoink out. Yoink. One. Not only two beds. Alright, time to get all these beds placed. And there's a creeper in here. And I don't have a weapon. <laughs> That's what happens when I don't light up my builds. 
or I don't have proper lighting. Creeper spawn, and I can't take him out. Just need one more for an iron axe. And now we can just boop, and now we can walk up that creeper and bop him on the head. I'm going to open this up. I'm going to shave all you guys. That's really a couple more beds right there. For right now, got to bop that creeper. Come here, come here, Mr. Creeper. I didn't get close enough. Bop you. And bop them on the head. So, bed. Bed. Doop and do. And pop, and pop, and pop, 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 pop. It's gonna look a lot of freaking beds right here. And got a yellow bed. And I think we can start moving villagers in, honestly. I mean, we're doing pretty good so far. Just got another tater. Go right in here. Okay, so we just place the door right here. So we'll have a button here and then the lever here. That's not that's not a lever. That is a bell. But the bell has to go inside of the building. Just like so. Then the Button goes there, so we can just get out. All right, sweet. And now we can just hang the bell up here, or something like that. Or we just do this. Now we can just hang the bell off of that. That works. That. Couldn't have gone better. That couldn't have gone better. I mean, a bit little, little waste of blocks, but I think it works. <laughs> All right. So next step is using this boat to collect the villagers, which that's going to be fun. If I can just leave that door open for now, I'm going to have to break this. Kill you. All I need is two villagers. So let's run over here. We'll get our villagers. Like so we, and, and like I said before, we just need two, and they should still be alive. There should be a couple villagers running around here somewhere. If I find them, I'll just put them in a boat. The odds are, I think they might be all dead, which is kind of unfortunate for me. Which is fine. I can just run to a neighboring town, which is, there seems to be plenty of them. Yeah, but those things, they're all dead here, so. Well, I guess I'm, guess I'm just going to jump cut to where we get a villager. And go, yep, go from there. And we're going to have to make two trips. This is going to be even, even more fun. So, you know, I'm just going to, yeah, like I said, yeah, jump cut. I, I got to get this. I, I gotta get my camera can off of this, or off of the world. So I just need one villager. Get in. Alright, get in the boat. There we go. Oh, where are you going? Get in the boat. Get in the boat. It's fine if you walk, like, a like, couple blocks away, because I can just throw you back over here. All I gotta do is make sure he finds his way inside. So, how we're going to do this is we are going to pop this fence down and just break the boat and hit the bell. He's gonna freak out and try to find a way inside. 
They're doing a good job. <laughs> keep, keep. It's working. <laughs> actually works. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That is funny. <laughs> they are keeping the slimes at bay. This is awesome. This is awesome. Alright, so pick a bell. I mean, not pick a bell. Pick a bed. Pick a bed. And now you're locked in there forever. Which is which is perfect. And now I don't have to relief. I think this is great. <laughs> this is great. Okay, so now what I could do here is I can get a couple stacks of carrots. That should be enough carrots for now to feed these guys. I mean, they can like live off of pretty much any like food source that's growable. Like I can grow, throw a weed at them. They can craft their own bread or whatever. All right, here. Here's what I want you boys to do. Or girls. I'm not exactly sure what you guys are. But you guys can pick up the carrots and start breeding. Breed! <laughs> Now, I don't think... Th Should I, like, name these guys so, like, they're known as, like, the OGs? But they're the original villagers? <laughs> if I ever get name tags, like, I'll make sure to rename these guys. Unfortunately, I can't, I can't use them only because of their, um, jobs. Because I, I, I guess I gotta break their, their, um, their workstation. But they're trying to track, they're trying to pathfind to it. But it's not working. But eventually, it's going to be nighttime, and they're going to have to sleep. So, go to your beds, and I'm going to leave. And I'm, I'm going to call this a wrap. So, if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and comment down below. Anything you want to see in a future video? Because you never know. I might just end up doing it. Now I am playing this on on the on the snapshot versions of Minecraft, so like every new snapshot that comes out, that's what, that's basically where I'm changing this world to. So it's a good chance that one of the next snapshots is gonna corrupt the world. Although I can't be be like I don't know, like 100% certain that it will corrupt. But in case the series ever ends without me dying, it's because the world got corrupted. Vice versa. But that, that, yeah, like I said, that's basically it. So go enjoy this. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. It's basically free. And um, yeah, y'all have a fantastic day. So what? So peace out. Take care. And bye bye.